should be the first man in space. <laughs> we have this idea of the Mercury 7 and the men are the heroes. Here's this story that we know so much about. What are the parts that we don't know? That's one of the things I love the most about this show is that it dives into that. Trudy, she was a pilot. It was a really tough time to be a female pilot. Trudy and Gordo had a deep love for the same thing, space, flying. Your husband races planes. I do. She's looking at these men and thinking, is there a world in which I could do that? She separated from Gordo. NASA told him that if they didn't have home lives that were stable, then they couldn't be astronauts. And so he begged her to come back. I need a big favor. This is a fresh start for us. I spent a lot of time thinking about, like, why would she come back? It's space. Trudy, please. At the time, there was no way for women to be involved in this program. And the closest that she could ever get to space was actually through him. An astronaut. I want to do it. Considering the limitations that women had on them at this time, it was really important for me to show that Louise was a true partner in this relationship. She was his confidant. Alan got to where he got because she was the person who helped him strategize and figure out which direction to take. Things are different now, and John Glenn's good at it. So if you really want to be first, you're going to have to get used to the limelight. She supported him in these crazy endeavors that he set out on and had the same sort of strong will and determination that he had. Don't worry, you'll be fine. Unless John kills him. I think what was really important for me to get across with Annie is how strong she was. She was very supportive, but she would put him in his place. Kennedy doesn't like the program? Change his mind. I just find her so fascinating because she had so many lives. She worked with people with disabilities, and she got her pilot's license. Annie absolutely had the right stuff. This is Jerry Cobb. She's a famous pilot. What's so interesting about this time is that it was before the sort of idea of modern feminism, but with grit and determination. Jerry Cobb hoped for something more. I want to build a female astronaut corps, and I want you to be a part of it. What's so appealing about the idea of the Mercury 13 program was that women were never assumed to have the right stuff. Why'd you stop it? Because you've been on it longer than anyone else ever. We're decades out from when the right stuff, both the movie and the book, were made. It's so interesting to look at this story with a current lens and to readdress this story of the women, the sexism of the time, the behind the scenes. Can't even imagine the amount of pressure that they were under. The ambition it took to try to get beyond obstacles that they were up against. It's a really powerful thing.